Welcome back to my channel. Angelica Bonilla here. Today, I'm going to take you to a spot where you can get some menudo. We're going to go check out the, this local spot here in Victorville. It's called La Vaquita, where they make handmade tortillas and they have some of the best menudo here in the HD. So, have you ever woken up where you're just tired and you're happy that the weekend is gone? and that your week that just passed is gone as well. And you're ready to take on the following week, but you just need a little pick-me-upper, okay? I'm Mexican, so usually what we do, we like to eat menudo, pozole, un caldo de res, un caldo de, like a seafood, okay? Some kind of soup to jump us back into life, okay? so. That's just how I woke up today here in the HD, okay? I woke up with that feeling that I just need to take my life back, okay? Because it was a long week, a long weekend. I feel, still, I feel tired, exhausted, and I just need a little bit of life, and I'm looking for some menudo in my life, all right? So if you've ever woken up with that feeling here in the high desert, trust me, you're not alone. I'm with you. And that's why I'm bringing you where you can buy the best menudo up here in the HD. All right, guys. So we're going to go check out La Vaquita here in Victorville. Hang tight because um, I heard the food is good. All right, guys. So it's in this shopping center right here. So that's the La Vaquita Mexican food. Let's go check out this menudo. Okay. It's in a pretty busy intersection, I guess, if you want to call it busy. Okay, exit Mojave Drive. It's right off of the freeway. You can't miss it. I guess it's next to a Little Caesars and a liquor store. So let's go check it out. It's right here. Local spot. Hey guys, so yeah, we came to La Vaquita here. They just opened up here in the HD. You guys definitely should come and try it out, okay? Uh, you know what I love the best are handmade tortillas or tortillas like calentitas like hechos a mano looker. However they make them but they make them nice and warm and ready to go. Okay so today I woke up so tired. I had a long week and I'm like I need a menudo. Thank God I called the owner here from La Vaquitas and guess what? He prepared me or he separated my menudo so I can come and enjoy and have a plate and i'm really grateful for him for doing that because i called him i'm like hey i'm a, i want a menudo he's like I, maybe i have one so he was gracious enough to separate my menudo okay look at that esto es para volver a nacer okay queremos volver a nacer aquí estamos in victorville okay y yo quiero volver a nacer trust me if you are looking for a spot to come and i know they have really tacos okay and you're looking for a spot i'm telling you this is why i came because i was seeing that they have these tortillas i rolled out of bed and i called him i'm like can you make can you separate me a bowl oh my god that's good nice and warm look at that everything for you to put on your menudo right there I'm halfway eating my tortilla and talking, guys. But you know how we gotta do it up in here. Okay. Mm -mm -mm. We're gonna go ahead and put all this stuff in. I'm gonna put some cilantro. I'm telling you guys, si quieres volver a nacer, come and have this menudo, okay? Just with the tortillas, I'll be back. That's my favorite. Put some lemon in here. It's a, it's a small little spot, but trust me, you should come and get it. Buenas tardes. We all come in with our special orders. No, I 
no, 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 Alright guys, so yeah, if you're in Victorville, come check out the menudo here in La Vaquita. Definitely recommend it. Okay. Mm. yeah guys so unfortunately the mic went out but it's okay i was trying to tell you guys how i was enjoying my menudo and i was actually going over their menu with you guys kind of uh, trying to explain to you what they have other items they have on their menu because they do sell birria um they have birria and sujugo they have birria tacos. Uh, they also have they also have agua chiles, a California burrito, and they I, I actually wanted to tell you that they have Taco Tuesday specials where you can get your tacos for two dollars and fifty cents on Tuesday with the five dollar beer. So definitely come check them out, and I know they have a really good menu for breakfast okay so uh, come check them out for breakfast they have like a, what is it croissants like a, a croissant croissant um, chilaquiles I think um, a couple of other items in their breakfast menu as well oh and I was actually telling you that they had gone to Mexicale to go get these plates for the restaurants okay so that's what was so nice because the owner was actually there uh, telling me the story how they went back to go get the plates um, for the restaurant. Okay, so I mean, that's why it's so nice to talk to a small business owner. You kind of see what their vision is, what their goal was. And um, this is a really great family that was able to open up their own business here in the hd okay this is what i mean about what the high desert has to offer um, especially if you're an entrepreneur and you're wanting to open like a small business in the community look at this family they went ahead and they um opened or bought this lo location and um, he was telling me that it was uh, one of his wife's uh, dream to have this restaurant or have this business so i mean and you can tell they're putting all their love sweat and uh energy into the business okay so come support la vaquita the owner was kind of telling me uh what was the favorites okay or what are the things that kind of sell out a lot okay he was saying number one is uh, menudo number two it's the birria with the con su jugo. Okay, and then number three, he had told me one more thing and I forgot, okay? So, yeah, guys. 
So he broke it down. I guess they sell out of their menudo. They sell out of their birria. So if you want menudo and it's after 11 on a Sunday, call him so that he can make sure that he has a plate for you, okay? So yeah, I mean, a great little spot. When I got there, the restaurant was full. And then was as I got my plate, the uh, table started leaving, okay? So it kind of works out for me, especially when I'm doing my reviews, right? All right, guys. So I hope that you've enjoyed this review on La Vaquita. Okay, I wish you would have been able to hear the owner just giving me all the information about um, the restaurant. But hey, you know what? It's okay. We keep going, okay? All right, guys. I hope that uh, you enjoyed this review because if you're like me sometimes you wake up and you just want a good tortilla and a good menudo we call it volver a nacer or you know like cuando tienes la cruda and you just need like a menudo or a caldo to come back to life but you know what i hadn't been i didn't even drink i was just tired okay i just felt tired of the week so yeah guys here i'm giving you a little like showing you the menu the place is pretty small like i said okay but what the what it has doesn't have in space okay you you could just tell that the owners are really nice okay come support them so yeah guys definitely come check out la vaquita look it's a small little spot but these are the spots that you're looking for especially out here in the high desert okay because i know a lot of people are moving here from la okay and you're looking for that food that you're used to hey guys sorry i guess my mic went out okay but it's to be expected there's always something that's going to happen but guess what we're not going to stop we're going to keep pushing forward and um yeah thank you so much for coming with me to come check out this local spot here in Victorville called La Vaquita. Uh, it's a little restaurant, okay, here in Victorville. They just opened up. Great uh, owners. I wish nothing but the best for them. Um, their new venture here in the high desert. I mean, I was talking to him and he's getting a lot of uh, people that are moving, that are just moving up to the high desert and they're like, oh, I didn't want no uh, Molly Brown's which is across the street from him or uh, maybe like uh, you know Cracker Barrel I wanted some good traditional Mexican food that's why we came in here uh, today okay so and that's kind of how I felt I just wanted something like I wanted a menudo okay so badly okay and um, yeah so you know what I picked a great spot come and support the this local business here in Victorville uh, come and uh, taste all their food. They have a great menu. They have birria uh, tacos. They have uh, birria con consomme. And they also have, um, what is it? The agua chiles. Okay, they have a bunch of stuff on their menu. So it's not only menudo, okay, for you to come and uh, check it out, okay? So uh, let me know what you think about their menudo, menudo if you do come and have uh, come try it out or uh, check them out. Okay, leave me a comment down below if you've been to the Vaquita here in Victorville and what is it that you think of their food. Okay, guys, uh, let's support these local businesses out here that um, and people that are bringing great restaurants like this here to the HD. All right, guys, I hope that you've enjoyed this quick uh, little video about a review of La Vaquita and the Menudo up here in the HD in Victorville. All right, guys, I thank you so much for watching my videos. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button, hit that like button. Okay, you already know I see you. You're not subscribed and I keep putting out good videos. All right, guys, so let me know what you think about La Vaquita if you come and check it out, okay? And also, uh, 
let me know down below what you think about the review or this video okay so now i'm gonna go ahead and give them a review okay so the review is one to five just kind of like a google review okay so la vaquita is gonna get a solid five i like the owner very attentive he welcomes you as soon as you walk in okay the food is authentic and good and you know why I give them a five? Because they have handmade tortillas. And they're not little tortillas. You saw it, it's a big tortilla that gives you a five and the menudo, okay? Cause you, I called you and you separated my menudo. <laughs> All right guys. So yes, La Vaquita gets a solid five from the Living in the High Desert team here in um, Victorville, California. All right, guys, like always, Angelica Bonilla here with Excellent Real Estate here in the HD. Remember, if you're looking to buy a home, you're moving from LA, you're looking to buy a home here in the High Desert, or if you're wanting to sell your home here and you're local, don't forget to give us a call, okay? Call us, text me, then I'll send you a quick answer, okay? <laughs> All right, guys, thank you so much for watching. Bye.